The first weekend of the Boys National League play wrapped up in North Carolina as teams battled it out for a top spot in the standings. In the under-15 Red Division, Georgia's GSA 01 Premier stayed within striking distance of second place Sparta 01 JK of Utah after defeating West Coast FC Armor 2-0. GSA opened the scoring in the 22nd minute when a cross was chipped in to Kendall Edwards. Edwards slotted his shot back post to give his side the 1-0 lead. Edwards' teammate Thomas Tony added the lone goal of the second half in the 51st minute to bring the final score to 2-0 for GSA. Under 16 Red Division, Dix Hills Hurricanes defeated Cal South's LA Galaxy South Bay Gold 1 0 to move into third place in the group with seven points, just one point behind the two leaders. Dix Hills' Samuel Steinberg scored the match's lone first half goal in just the sixth minute of play. In the second half, both teams had opportunities with LA hitting the post and Dix Hills having the shot saved on the line. LA pressed for the equalizer but couldn't find the back of the net and the game finished 1-0 in favor of the Eastern New York side. Oh, well, we were very happy on, with the level. Really, it's tremendous competition. I think that uh, uh, at times and scouting uh, academy uh, games as well, and I don't think that uh, I, I think that uh, this game that has nothing to uh, be ashamed of the academy games as well. I mean, it's, it's a great competition, great level. Uh, uh, the games and uh, the, the referees are allowed to play, but it's a fair play, and uh, we can see a lot of good players, a lot of good teams, and as you see, the matches are. Uh, except a few of them, most of them ended up one nothing, two one, uh, 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 and very close matches. Also, uh, all of them. Santa Barbara SC White defeated SAC Premier Blue 4-1 to remain undefeated and untied in the under-18 Red Division. SAC took the early lead with just eight minutes in when Luca Fazio got on the end of the long throw ball. His initial shot was saved, but he tapped in his own rebound to put SAC up 1-0. Santa Barbara didn't wait long to respond, and just seven minutes later, Matthew Batista equalized with a shot to the upper corner. Dennis Cole brought the score to 2-1 as he danced behind the SAC defense and around its keeper before he slotted home his game winner. Santa Barbara's Christian Lopez and Brandon Sanchez each added goals in the second half to bring the final score to 4-1. In the under-16 Blue Division play, Houston Express of Texas South defeated Arizona's Scottsdale Blackhawks 99 Davidson 3-1. The win gives them 7 points on the week, just 3 points behind Baltimore Celtic 98-99 and Sporting St. Croix who sit at the top of the division. Houston puts the pressure on early with goals from Samuel Adiron and Peter Prentice in just the first 6 minutes of the game. A Houston own goal in the 74th minute brought the game to 2-1 and gave Scottsdale hope for a comeback. Just eight minutes later, Adoran had a ball poked away from him as he danced around the top of the Scottsdale box. The loose ball fell to Houston's Saul Amaya, who smashed his chance past the Scottsdale keeper to bring the final score to three to one. You know, they train three, four times a week. Um, they've, they've been, they, they believe in the club, they believe in the system. And to see them kind of get these rewards is it's what we're in the game for. We're delighted for them from a coaching staff uh, point of view. Dix Hills Elite defeated FC Dallas 98 Premier 1-0 in the under-18 Blue Division play for its second win of the week. 
A back and forth game saw both teams with chances early, but the only first half goal came when Dix Hill's Taylor Kaczynski got on the end of a through ball in the 32nd minute and finished his chances past the sprawling FC Dallas keeper. FC Dallas couldn't find an equalizer in the second half and the score remained 1-0 at the final whistle. Georgia's United FA Premier played Dallas Texans of North Texas to a 0-0 draw on the final day of the Under-16 National League play to keep both teams tied with eight points at the top of the Red Division. Dallas had a handful of attempts in the second half that were all thwarted by United FA's Jonathan Rushton. Rushton's best save came early in the second half when he pushed a point-blank header wide of his net to keep the teams level. Follow the moments during the National League season on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram.